Hey guys, here's a way to, uh, when you're painting to get into those pesky little edges. I'm sure when you go buy your brushes and stuff, you see these in the store. And uh, you say to yourself, okay, well, what, what is that for? What am I going to use that for? Or, uh, that thing just looks like a gimmick. It actually works really well and it saves you a lot of time. It does a nice cut on the corners. So let me show you how it's done. First, you need your edger. Second, you're going to need a paint pen. And you're going to want to fill it, eh, about so far. Because you're going to want to dip this in a special way. And I'll show you in a moment. So first, I'm going to unwrap okay, it. Okay, now here we go. Here's the edger. You see? It's got like a little pad on the bottom. And on the top, it's got these little clips. When you dip it in, you want to pull them up. When you put them up, when you put it uh, on the wall against the surface, you want to have these two leaning against the surface. Make sure they're clean because it will get paint over everything. And here's how you dip it in. You take it, you dip it just the top in. Make sure these are up, and then you take it, put it right against the side. Once again, dip the top, and this is the first time doing this, so you got to get it a little wet first. And then of course, take it up against the side. Now if you can see, the bottom is covered right nicely and these are still nicely protected so one last time just since this is the first time you only have to do this one time once you get this past the first time past the first time got it bottom is wet i'll show you how it works so now i've went ahead and put these down okay and i'm just going to pick something on the exterior of this house that i'm working on here let's try just this edge There you go. Voila, it works great on the inside too. And then check this out. We're doing the bottom here. All we gotta do is go like that. That was quick, huh? See you guys. See you guys, it's all about having the right tools to adjust the technique on how to use them correctly. It makes that job so easy. Look how quick that was. There's another tricky place. How about the corner of this fence here? Without getting paint on the fence. Brushes are very hard to do that with. But you take your little thing, after you dip it back in again, snap it down, make sure that there is no paint on those top parts, and follow it through. I have a little spot up there, all I need to do is go right here. And then down there. And then get the bottom of it more, and look at that. We just cut in that fence in a matter of 10 seconds.